or, uh, you know, whatever, and, uh, oh, you know, you know, when was the last time you, you had anything, and blah, 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 and uh, Bob's your uncle. So 14 was what I needed uh, for that black katana, because uh, that's something else we're going to be rolling with as well. So we got that now, so now I can go and get uh, another weapon. Uh, you just, you just got back from work, but it's so late. Or are you, you know, you're a West Coaster, though, aren't you? You're a West Coaster. I was, I, you know what I was going to fucking do today? I going to go out. I, I'm, try, I'm trying to, I have to say, like, uh, I, I just started using this green screen program uh, for called VCAM from XSplit. I'm liking it. I really am. But one of the problems of it is uh, you need proper lighting, and I don't have proper lighting. So an evening stream like this doesn't work too bad because uh, generally there's no... Um, there's no sunlight coming in from from beside me, even though I got shitty blinds, well, shitty curtains, I guess. They let too much uh, light in. Um, but I know that lighting is, is going to be the proper fix for that. So I really don't want to buy a ring light. You, you know, they're, it's not that it's the money. Uh, they're only 100 bucks. What, what bothers me with it, frankly, is the... Um, it's, it's the... Uh, well... It's how big it is. It's huge. Uh, it's a 14-inch ring light. There isn't really anything smaller than that. Um, but, uh, I don't know. All right, yeah, so here's, here's what we're looking at. The black steel katana. Uh, we can roll with that. So that'll be my second weapon, I guess. I just want to see what else I have. Oh, I got two of them. Perfect. So I could probably, uh, yeah, we're just going to get that thing up now. Um, but, yeah, so that's sort of the, the thing. That's sort of the thing. Uh, you're just now hopping into a new company, so I'm really getting to feel that shit out before I try it. Yeah, exactly, right? I've, I've been with my company for, for 10 years. So, I mean, not that I'm ever overly worried about uh, doing anything wrong, but you never know type of thing, right? So, I more so prefer them to get that stuff ironed out because, you know what, I, I it sort of is treated like, like booze. I mean, I, you can't go into work hammered, right? That, that pretty much is works for any job, right? But, you know... Smoking a joint, you know, 30 or 45 days ago, and that's still popping up on your system. That's a problem. That's that's a definite problem. So, you know, that's that's where we're we're at with that type of stuff. So, uh, we're gonna reinforce a, a weapon and armor. Uh, we're gonna get that black. Uh, where the fuck is it? Well, I got a lightning. What, the, what does this mean? Is that broken? What, I don't mean, lightning short. Sure. Why are we not using that anymore? I don't fucking know. All right. Anyways, is this a pig shield? The poor kind shield. Look at these beautiful shields. Golden Falcon Shield, Wicked Eye, Great Shield, Watch Dragon Parma. That's that's uh, that sounds like it's a, a you know a pasta dish or something like that. There we go. That's what we wanted right there. The Black Steel Katana. That's what we want, ladies and gentlemen. All right, let's start reinforcing it. Uh, we got a bunch of shards. We, I'm more so actually worried about the um, the souls. We're not going to have enough souls to to do everything. Damn it, Bobby! Uh, what are we at right now with it? Black Steel, nine, four. That's not too bad. Not too bad. Dragon Parm is better than Chicken Parm. What about, though, in comparison to the Veal Parm? You know, those baby cows, you know, sometimes. Sometimes, right? All right. So now we got to go back to see the wizard. The wonderful wizard of Oz. All right, we're back. We're rest. We're going to travel. Where was it we were? I don't even know. Like, it, it, this is the problem. Did you write? Sure. King's Gate? That sounds about right. And which Spice Girl are we talking here? What's your favorite Spice Girl? Come on. I mean, it, it's got to be Ginger, right? It's got to be, right? Yeah, I like to hear it screaming, Mommy, Mommy, Moo, before I eat that shit. Yeah, that's how most people like it, right? Um... You're you're gonna come one of you's get yep. It's not both of you. Oh god. Come on, buddy. Come on. Come on, come on. Oh yo, okay, you almost got me. Almost. Oh, oh, okay, oh, oh, angry, angry! Hey. Get that shit out of here, okay? We're not interested in that shit. There we go. Maybe some life gems. Okay, now, do, is it your turn? Is it your turn to come alive? No? Alright, what's this? I don't have no symbol of no king! You jerk! I'm a ginger, so I'm not super about other... <laughs> about other ginger chicks. Which Spice Girl has the biggest hits? Because that, that, that would be definitely Ginger Spice. So, there you go. 
Even though that's not what you wanted, that's what you got. Oh, this is just, this is just a room full of terror. Hey, exterior dear, the asshole has arrived. Cheers to the assholes in the room. There we go, buddy. How you doing, exterior dear? Good to see you. Fuck no, I'm not no fucking king. I'm a queen, if anything. Yep. Yeah. Oh, pff, motherfucker. Oh, God. Sit down and shut up. You jerk. Stop scaring me. No reason for you to come up on me like that. I really feel like I probably are going to have to uh, up my brightness soon because I can't uh, really see well with these glasses. Well, I can. You know, it's all for effect, right? I know you like those weirdos that wear those uh, ray gunners because I'm going to tell you, oh, you know, when you stream all day, the light from the computer screen really gets to me. Give me a fucking break, you stupid fucks. That's all I have to say about them. You see, if you get on them quickly enough, then they're not a problem. You're the king of being an asshole, are you? Are you? Ugh, a door opened. Oh, God! <laughs> oh, God. Oh, yep, yeah, okay, I forgot about that length of reach that you got there, princess. Oh, God. Ooh, lordy. Just pulled that one off. I bet you were happy to see him again. I'm, I'm as happy to see anybody. You know, pretty much that's how it is. So, uh, I just did research on her tits. Good. They are rather small. Hers being the biggest is like being the, like, <laughs> the tallest Asian. I mean, but relatively speaking, they were still uh, the biggest, I believe, of all of them. I mean, it's definitely not... Uh, you know, um, what's her face? Posh or Sporty Spice? It ain't those two. It ain't Mel B. It ain't Scary Spice either. And we all know it's not Baby Spice. So, relatively speaking, uh, I'm correct. Yes. Well, you know, I'm a little bit more stronger, right? You know, level 104 in comparison to, like, what? Level 20 was the last time I saw that jerk off? Sure. Black Spice? Yeah, maybe. Maybe. Dennis Varga, how you doing, buddy? If you push... Forward and L1, I can kick a shield from the enemy hand and after do a critical attack. Denise, that's Dark Souls 3, not 2. Well, where are we here, folks? Where are we with that? Is, is it, is it, uh... Yeah, because that, that's, what, that's what forward and L1 does, and that's what... That's Perry. That's Luke Perry right there, so, you know, it does a bunch of stuff. A oh, Pharaoh's Lockstone, look at that. Can I do this? I'm trying it, buddy. I'm trying it. It only does this. It only, it only does this stupid thing. See, it does that, and then it does that. It's, yeah, you don't kick, though. I should probably really start getting up on that parrying, but you know what? I'm such shite at this game, because it, it doesn't even matter. It doesn't even, oh, I bet, oh, no, you guys open things for people. You're, you're nice people, at least now. At least now, right? All right, get alive, kill you. I'm just super afraid of some other jerk off just coming up alive and just gonna come up behind me and stick a giant, a giant stick on my butt and it's gonna be like Gaddafi all over again. That poor guy, right? Oh, appreciate you lighting the room, boys. Appreciate it. Oh God, what are you doing? Okay, thank God. Lighting the Olympic torch, I guess. Push it together one time. I did. What do you, what do you, what do you think I was doing it? That's that's what it does. I walk forward. You know, like, boys, I can't. I, I can't really do much more than that. Don't have expectations too high here, ladies and gentlemen, okay? Just remember, Katy Perry, hey! Yeah, Katy Perry. Katy Perry's a hot fuck. Yes. Yes, she is. What, who, what, what, was it Russell Brand she, she was married to briefly? How, the, how did he fuck that thing up, right? How did he fuck that up? What are, these, what are these guys doing? Are they opening a door for me? What's going on? That's called a guard break. I don't know what the fuck to do. Okay, relax. Relax, boys. Oh, wait. No, that's where I came from. No, wait. It's not. Oh. 
Oh, okay. That's what we're doing. We're lighting up weird doors and shit. Oh, is that what that did? Oh, sh why? Why, why, why? Oh, okay. Oh, I got super lucky there. God, such anger from a woman. Why are they so mean? Like, what did I ever do to them? It's not like I'm their ex-boyfriend or something like that. Ugly trash can boy. It's called a garb... I didn't even realize you were a new person. Welcome to the stream. I, wow, I, the names of the viewers tonight are all over the place. We got we got assholes everywhere. Sex expectations are big. Uh, we all know that we would just uh, severely, severely disappoint them, right? Isn't that, isn't that how we were generally can go? At? How you doing? Welcome to the stream. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Fuck, where's the viewership coming through now? I think I think we're finally hitting it, boys. I think we're finally figuring it out. All oh, for fuck's sakes. Thank God you didn't touch me with your ugly stick. Okay, okay. now you touch me with the ugly stick. There we go. Now you're dead. Now you're dead. Ruin leggings. Can't you give me good leggings? Can't you give me good leggings? Am I really the true asshole? Let me ponder. You know, I don't... When, so, when you don't even have to ponder that for a long time... Generally, probably, yes. You're probably correct. Yeah, we use Monopoly money, and it's also is worth just as much as Monopoly money as well. <laughs> yep, all the colors of the rainbow, too. Oh, oh, now we got face two, you jerk-offs. No, that's fine. Thank God he hit a fucking wall, though, you retard. Oh, wait, is that one of those things that you can't use on stream? That that word? Is that okay? Is that join the list of, uh, of craziness words? I always, uh, you know, every once in a while, I, I always have the approach that Michael Scott from The Office, uh, he had a saying for the word retarded. Uh, and, and his take was that you can't call other people retarded because that's in bad taste. But you can certainly call your friends retarded when they act retarded. And I think that makes a lot of sense, so. <laughs> Alright, I, I, I want to, like, murder most of these people in here. What are my cats going, what are you guys going crazy about? Are you playing? Gavin, be nice. Bunch of crazies. All right, I, I, did we did we relinquish everybody here? We need to go in this door. Um, all the colors except white. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. Uh, are all your different shapes and sizes like yours? No, no. All of our money is got is exactly the same size. I think like. Aren't, isn't American money uh, different sizes for the denomination, or are they all equal sizes as well? That dirty, dirty green. Sir, would you like to come alive? Sir? Anybody? Bueller? Oh, man. The coins are different? Well, I mean, so are our coins. I mean, we're really fucked up. We don't, we don't, I mean, we've, we've smartened up. I mean, we don't have the, uh, the penny anymore. Um, and, um, we got a toonie. We got a loony. We got all that crazy shit. I have a feeling that guy's going to pop up. A You're going to come alive right as soon as I pick up this fucking thing. You pipsqueak. You jerk. Don't stop scaring people. No, no I mean quite fr oh god. I mean quite frankly, uh I wish I would you know, we're we're fairly close with getting to a, a moneyless society, but you know my take on that now is I wish we would adjust a little bit quicker. Um, but you know, I, I for one am not a fan of carrying around money. I have no need for it, you know. Everything's paid by cards nowadays, so what does it matter? I'm surprised none of these things came alive yet. I should probably like feel like I should up my uh, my brightness just a little bit, just for me. 
just for me, little old me. Are you gonna come alive, you jerk? No, I don't even know where I'm going here. I don't. You look like you're from Final Fantasy XI, like one of those goblin guys. Uh, it's hard to be a stripper with a card. True, but you know what? Uh, this is sort of cruel but funny at the same time. So out west, uh, I believe it's like Alberta, which is similar to America's Texas, um, you know, where the, the, the oil fields are and whatnot. So uh, what, what apparently they were doing out there with, um, with the strip joints and whatnot um, was they were lighting toonies and loonies um, with a lighter and then flicking them at the, at the stripper. <laughs> I mean, that's really mean, but it's, it's really funny. It's really funny. Hey, it's not my life choice. Who the fuck is name alive? I'm gonna assume I can't go in there. It's just, I mean, it's probably Tang, but I'm gonna assume it, you can't go in there. Ow! Oh, you. Ch oh, shit. I mean, who doesn't like Tang, right? Like, that's the astronaut's drink, right? Cashless society means that people can be demonetized from society for political opinions, just like what is happening on the internet right now. So I will not stop using cash until I have no other options. I, I mean, I, defunct, when I, when I do say that, I'm, I'm hoping that that type of thing doesn't happen. But I, I certainly agree with you uh, on your statement that, of course, that can happen. And that does, what you know, we'll never, ever get away from money, right? Like, that will always be treated with... Uh, you know, legal tender and, and people always going to want to pay with money for, for a lot of things, right? But I do agree with your statement. It's just, you know, for the law-abiding citizens of the world who maybe just assume everything's going well and good in the world, that's my hope. But, you know, I understand what you're saying too, of course. Of course I do. So we treat our strippers like goddesses. Strippers on average make 100. Well, you know what though? It's funny. Uh, there was a um, there was a uh, a news article I read about a week and a half ago, two weeks ago, and there was it was talking about the myth of of the hundred thousand dollar a year uh, waitress or waiter, right? And, and so you might be thinking like, well, okay, maybe we're talking like in a nice high end restaurant, which that wouldn't surprise me at all. But you have to remember, how many of these people are always uh, you know telling the government of their tips, right? You go to a really nice restaurant if your meal is a hundred, hundred fifty, two hundred dollars, and you're tipping twenty percent. That's a lot of chunk of change that they're making extra on top, right? So if they're not declaring that to, you know, the, the IRS or, or uh, you, know, um, you know, the government equivalent, you know, uh, as ours is Revenue Canada or whatever, you know, like, of course you can make that. It's all under the fucking table. Heck, I could go out and make 100 k a year if I'm not fucking having to pay out half of my fucking uh, government allowance to them, right? Like, but that's how it works. If, if you're going to have cash given to you like that's why of course they prefer a cash tip because then it doesn't go through the credit card companies and then they don't have to actually say it right uh, law buying systems are being demonetized on the internet now by paypal patreon youtube the platform by yeah so you're, you're referring to like the the alex jones um uh I, I believe there's a couple others that were just uh, recently mentioned um that were uh demonetized from patreon yeah like that sucks right because not that I'm saying that I agree with any of, you know, what Alex Jones says. Like, quite frankly, I listen to the Joe Rogan podcast, and when he has that crazy fuck Alex Jones on, I look at it as, it as entertainment. But, unfortunately, not everyone is as smart as I am. And so some people treat that as if it's the truth. And so that's the problem of where you get into that type of shit, right? But I, I can't control what other people want to, want to believe. Oh, God! What happened there? Did, did something get shot? Whew. Got fucking ninja. Uh, you worked for one place where they probably served like 50 dinners a night, and there was only one waitress who was the owner's daughter. She got all the tips every night and worked fucking hard. She had to make a fat salary on top of that. It was her second job. Yeah, but isn't, isn't Alex Jones a nut? And also being funny, the same thing to me. Like, that's that's me. He's a nut. 
he's funny because he's a nut. But there's a there's a problem. There are people who are believing the the, the bullshit that comes out of his mouth, right? That's the problem, right? And but but that's why I don't agree with like why Patreon is is getting rid of him, right? So you're telling me because the morons don't understand that what he's saying is not real, um, that he now loses his his uh, way of making money? I, I guess I guess that's the way the world is now, right? Which is super terrible, but um, oh, I wonder if that's the queen. Not too bad. I mean, she doesn't have the tits that uh, Eiferlin's looking for, but you know what? She probably has money, and you know, with money she could buy those tits, right? Yeah, we are what we eat. Yeah, pretty much. Exactly. Petrified dragon bone. Oh, shit. Get one more in you. Kill it. Get those iframes. Shit. Still come alive anymore, people. Come on, boy. He's dead. Fake tits are a lie and a crime. I need some big old natural swangers. <laughs> and then you're gonna tell us all that they uh, feel like sand, right? <laughs> Oh, look at that fucking spin move. Aren't you fucking jazzy? You belong in Vegas, good sir. They're gonna put a shoe on for you. Not dead, though. Not dead. I mean, you know what? Eiferlin, you could become a fat fuck yourself. You might be fat, I don't know. I've never met you. I've never seen a picture of you. But, uh, you know, you could always grow your own pair of titties and, you know, save yourself from going through the middleman, right? You know, I'm just saying, jug, 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 right there for you, right? But I feel you. I feel you. I mean, I certainly hope I'm going the right way. This is... Oh, God. Oh, no! Nameless... Oh, okay. You want to fucking go? Fucking... Are you kidding me? Ugh. Ow! You... Penis! No, he's got me trapped! Fuck you. Fucking cheese doodles. You fucking are everywhere. If you became that fat, you would no longer be flexible enough to fuck those titties, so what's the point? Well, then you just need to grow a bigger penis. That's what... I mean, look, I'm coming up with all of the fixes here for you, okay? I can't do everything here for you, Eiferlin. I mean, a man can only get so hard, correct? Oh, you fucking... Oh... God! Ah! Uh, run, 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 run. Run in here. Use one of these. Hopefully that fat fuck followed me down here. Come on, big boy. There we go. Let's have a real fight. Let's have a real good fight. Okay. Okay. I forgot you have a... Shield. Shield, man. You are shield, man. Oh! Oh! Yeah, we got the backstab on your ass. Stick that up, your bum Gaddafi. How'd you like that, eh? All the crumpets that you could ever have in the world. And you're a dead man now. Thank you for coming on out. Appreciate it. Um... Do I think Canada is on the right path and Trudeau is good for Canadians? I mean, uh, you're, you're lucky. I, I, I'm, I'm uh, one of those weird streams that uh, apparently doesn't mind talking politics. Um, although, of course, you can thank Donald Trump, I guess, for that, for the majority of, uh, of uh, streamers and whatnot. But uh, I, I voted for Trudeau. So, I mean, make your political opinions aside of that. Um, I think so. I think he's welcome change. Uh, even though I was a fan of the previous Harper government, um, you know, sometimes I believe some of the things that that man was uh, getting to later on in his uh, term were becoming a little bit more of a, a dinosaur type of approach to politics. But uh, sort of in the way we are now, it would sort of be 
good to have Harper in. I think Trudeau, you know, his honeymoon is over. Um, we're going to start waiting for action. Um, well, I mean, that's that's a weird thing. So, like, uh, because, you know, we are America's hat, as, as we're known. Uh, in general, we do know a lot about America as well as Canadian politics. Generally, about, almost about the world. Because generally, usually nothing ever happens in Canada. Um, at least not newsworthy, anyways. Um, so we, we get dumped on with, with all, of, you know... Where, where's this guy shooting me from? Oh, right there. Uh, he came up all the way... Oh, God. Uh, so generally, we, you know, I get, I get a little bit of everything... Um, but that just means that the rest of the world generally isn't fucking up as, as terribly as we are, I guess? No, I didn't want to go out there. I mean, maybe I do, but that could be a pain in the ass. Um, but yeah, so I, I think he's, he's, he's on the right path, but uh, he's got to be careful because, you know, next year he's got uh, another election. Um, and I don't think, uh, you know, if he, if he keeps the same path... Uh, he will not uh, win in a landslide like he did previously. People just want to change, right? Like, that was the argument for Trump. Now, I'm not dare comparing both Trump and, and Trudeau because they're two very, very different people, two very different uh, sides of the coin. Um, but even our, our conservative, which would be your, your equivalent Republican, I guess would say, um, you know, are very, very different. You know, they're not even close. Um, not even close, so. Oh. I don't know what that is. That's probably a boss fight. A question that is off topic. What is your soul memory? My soul memory is... Uh, I believe that number is... 9,577,000... Oh, my... Hold on. Let me get that number right for you. 957,775. I believe that's the number you were looking for. I believe. I, 